What's up guys? I'm Wei. Welcome back to my channel. And now I am at Fengshan Dadong Wenhua Yusu Zhongxin. The last time I came to Dadong Wenhua Yusu Zhongxin is probably one year ago. And today I came here again. And what's my plan today? Did you guys remember I have asked you guys uh, Q&A? When I have reached 20,000 subscribers, I already choose 50 questions from you guys. So I will answer you at Dadong文化艺术中心. I will find one place, then we can start today's video. So just follow me, find a place. Oh. <laughs> All right, guys. I decided to sit over here and start today's topic. Yes, 50 questions from you guys. The questions are Chinese, right? But I will answer you guys in English. Let's start it. Yeah, 50 questions. I will spend my time with my family and start to film the vlog in Taiwan in English. Let more and more foreigners watch my video. Yeah, that's it. Uh, are you talking about study English? If yeah, if you are talking about study English, I would say the cost of living in Philippines is more reasonable. So that's why I choose Philippines. And second is because I am the ocean boy. I really like the activity which is relative to ocean. So. That's why. If you want to do some scuba diving or free diving, Philippines is the first selection because you just need to spend like a half hour, then you can arrive the ocean and start to do that activity. Mm. Okay. Oh, that's a fifty percent from myself or by myself. I I'm not sure my grammar. Please uh, correct my grammar if I speak in the wrong way, okay? Please, <laughs> let me know that. Okay, so 50% by myself and another 50% by my parents, okay? Oh, I would say the most missed thing in Australia is the lifestyle. I pretty like the lifestyle in Australia. Uh, I mean, I just need to uh, walk uh, five days per week, then I can totally enjoy my weekend. And the quality is is not bad. It's better than Taiwan. Like, I can just go to the park and have some bobby, and I can also buy pretty good quality food, I mean, the ingredients like the lobsters, and long shell lobsters. Lobsters. And cedar nose? No, no cedar nose. I won't eat cedar nose. What? <laughs> no, not cedar nose, sorry guys. <laughs> like lobsters. I mean the ingredient is pretty good, okay? And uh, you also can save money. Oh I know I feel a little dizzy, you know. I'm not I don't know why. I think it's because Today is too hot and yeah it's too hot so I feel dizzy. Okay so that is my answer. Next. Definitely. Yes. Okay, the next and last one would hold at Kaohsiung. The exact date still not sure. If it comes out, I will tell you guys in Instagram story. Okay? Uh yes, yes, I will go to Australia. Uh, to be honest, now I am apply for my second year working holiday holiday visa. So if I can successfully apply for that, yeah I will go to Australia again and maybe I will go to Melbourne. Cool. Next one. Okay, it depends on what kind of job. If the treatment 
I mean the payment is good. Maybe I will think about it. But now I'm still not sure because I want to travel. I mean explore a lot of country. I'm the son of Queen. So not now. Next one. 第九题，有想过在台湾或者他国稳定下来吗？他国，哦，没关系。This question is so tricky because I have answered it. Last question I already answered. I'm the son of Queen, so not now. It's still not sure. Okay, next. 第十题，请问魏的爸妈对于小孩刺青的想法是什么？嗯，爸爸先说，还是妈妈先说？好，你先说。先提防，不受之父母，可能会伤孝之心。如果魏下次要刺青之前，请务必要跟我们告知，一起
you can make a friend pretty easy. 十八题在菲律宾的语言学校的课程都在学什么 ？I have filmed this topic video before. If you want to know it more, you can you can click the link over here and go to take a look. 十九题到国外生活，起初在沟通上会很困难吗 ？Yeah, of course. Because the environment in Taiwan is Chinese, we always speak Chinese. So if we turns out, I mean, we move to another place which is speaking English all the time, yeah, you absolutely will feel weird and uncomfortable. One month later, you will get used to it. You will feel more comfortable and know how to communicate with those foreigners. So that is not a big problem. You can, you will get used to it. 二十题是什么原因让你决定创立这个频道 ？The original reason is because I just want to record my life in Australia and also share share some experience which I'm fast because I know there are a lot of backpackers who want to come to Australia as well. That's why. Let you guys more some information before you come to Australia. The second reason is when I getting old, and I can watch the movie again. When I play the movie, it can re re recall my memory. And I don't know now. I already have forty thousand subscribers. Maybe it's just a coincidence. Thank you guys. 二十一题可以说说关于分享会的心得吗 ？Okay. Wow. Um, <clears throat> it's pretty complicated. I mean, yes, it was very nervous at first, but when I start to share my experience, I feel I feel like all of you guys are my friends. So I just share my experience to you guys. So I I didn't feel nervous at that moment. I feel pretty glad because it's my honor to share those stories to you guys. I was very happy at that moment. 二十二题，想问澳洲打工度假的各种方法。Firstly, do not provoke original because they are dangerous. Some of them are dangerous, honestly. Okay, and secondly.、Um, Prepare your English capability before you go to Australia. That is quite important. Oh, that's it. 二三题，在澳洲念语言学校的时候是用打工度假的签证吗 ？Yes, I was using working holiday visa while I study English in Australia. 二四题，上次 Q&A 提到有对象，知道了吗 ？Actor. Yes. 二十五题，会尝试跟其他 YouTuber 合作吗？ Yeah, I want to cooperate with Ku, Ku the Mon, and Xiao Fei.、Uh, both of them are foreigners. They are outdoor YouTubers as well. And also, Taiko Stories, Taiko Chi Chang, Lao Yan. Actually, I want to cooperate with a lot of YouTubers. So if I got chance, I will go to practice it. 二十六题，怎么会有想法先去菲律宾再到澳洲 ？Some of friends, I think you already knew why I go to Philippines first. Because I think if you improve your English before you go to Australia, you can get more and more opportunities. I mean, the job opportunities in Australia. You also can find those、uh, better and. An illegal job in Australia. 二十七题，你会不会唱歌 ？Yes, I can. Baby, sha do 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 do. Baby, sha do 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 do. Baby, sha do 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 do. Baby, sha. Mommy, sha do 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 do. Mommy, sha do 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 do. Mommy, sha do 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 do. Sha be. Mommy, sha. Thank you. I can sing the song. 二十八题，在澳洲打工带给你最棒的体验或是回忆是什么？呃、uh, ，skydiving and swim with sea lions. OK. 二十九题，如果英文不好，直接去澳洲会不会很冒险 <coughs> ？Let me tell you guys. Uh, if today you can't speak English, then go to Australia. I would say 
yeah, you can, but it's hard to find a good job. So I suggest you guys prepare, yeah, prepare your English and let your English ability better before you go to Australia. It's pretty helpful, really pretty helpful. Maybe it would be a small problem. I mean, if you're, you can't speak English, then you go to Australia, you still can find a job. But probably the job is illegal and also the payment is not so good. So it, it depends on you guys, what kind of job you want to find or do. Mm. So maybe it's a little bit risky, a little bit. I went to Australia when I was 24 years old and I'm worried about uh, if I can't get a job, how will it be? But basically, if I didn't find a job in Australia, I just come back to Taiwan. So that is not a problem. The most interesting thing that must be done in Australia. Oh, skydiving. Yeah, I would say skydiving. And also, rent a recreational vehicle and have a big road trip. Yeah, you must do that. <laughs> My opinion is that I think everyone is equal in this world and we can love whoever we want to love. So it's no matter your sexual identity. I have a lot of homosexual friends and I treat them as my heterosexual friends. How long you have been learning your English and way to speak and listen better in English by home learning? Okay, okay. I have mm, learned my English over 20 years. Since I was a kindergarten student, yeah, I already learned English. But that is our Taiwan's education. All of Taiwanese must to do that, right? But if we talk about self-study English, I would say probably three or four years, I start to do that. I watch video from YouTube, and that moment, I already graduate from my college. Okay, I will focus on introduce Taiwan in English and let more foreigners know about Taiwan. But I will, I will go back to Australia, so the topic is not a problem. Okay, I know a lot of people, they think Christians cannot have a tattoo on our body. But in my opinion, I think as long as the tattoo is not related to Sanskrit or totem, then we can we can have it. Oh yes, we rarely use English because our national language is Chinese or Taiwanese. Hmm. No, I never have it, but I, I'm thinking about it. Okay, I feel that I can share anything with him or her, no matter delight, anger, sorrow, or happiness. Yeah, I can share with them. That is my good friend. Okay. I had and the party. Yeah, it, it, it is the special party. They always discuss my future with me. They are really want to know what am I think, what do I want to do. Yeah, so I would say my parents is pretty respect to me. <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't know how to dance. Before I attend the Hop Dance Club. Right? Hop Dance Club. Okay, next. Uh, I just want to explore this world. That's it. No, I'm a normal Taiwanese person. So I just like you. I don't have those uh, English environments. Mm. Oh, it depends on topic. For example, if today we are talking about science, 
I will think it in Chinese and translate to English. But if today we are just chatting, then I, I, I don't know think too much. I can uh, speak out directly. Oh, uh, I don't like to memorize vocabulary. To be honest, I usually watch video. If I watch watch that video and I realize, oh, that vocabulary appeared so many times, and it's close. I can't understand just because of that vocabulary. Then I will post the movie and go to Google it. What's the meaning of the vocabulary? Same as reading. If today I read a book and one of word, it shows up so many times, and I can't understand the contents of the reading. I will stop it and go to find the meaning. Oh yes, it's quite interesting because uh, the biggest challenge is that my teacher they teach me English in <laughs> English because the education in Taiwan all of teachers they teach us English in Mandarin so that is the biggest differences between um, Taiwan and Australia. I learned my accent on YouTube. Okay, I, I watch video on YouTube. <laughs> really? Or like Netflix, some movies in English. I would say IELTS. I mean, OZ people, they don't know what is TOEIC, honestly. TOEIC is more for Asian zone or the United States. So for the Australia and England, they are more tends to IELTS. Who asked this? <laughs> Five? Okay, six. 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 Next. Oh, 50. Oh, finally. Oh, oh, so tired. Can I speak Chinese? Can I. Okay, I'll speak Chinese. Yeah, it's actually quite tired. 因为直接把五十题全部冲完，蛮累的，超累超累。我现在终于录完了，而且有点，我觉得我有点快要中暑的迹象，真的，就是好热哦、喔，而且头有点晕。这个柳橙汁都变温的了。OK， so this is today's video. I hope you guys like 大东艺术中心， and now I'm going to take some picture. And if you like today's video, please share my video to your friends. And drop me a like. Subscribe my channel if you are new here. I'm Wei. Wei. See you guys in next one.